Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go ahead and click that red button right there. And also click that bell for notifications and select all. All right. Yo, 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 this is Gamesy Graphics. We are back in the building with another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you. And today we are going to be installing a Blender plugin. This one right here is created by Skylums. Shout out to Skylums for this right here. Um, Skylums has created a, a couple of uh, useful tools for us and this one right here is definitely going to be useful. We are going to be able to import and export um, GTA 5 files to Blender, all right, with this plugin right here, okay? So it's the same thing like we were able to do with 3ds Max, except we could do it with Blender now, all right? So once you get down to this uh, download page right here, what you want to do is scroll down, read the full description, all right? I can't, I can't uh, urge that enough to read the full description. It has a lot of important information it also has a link to um, a website that has uh, some tutorials for you as well just in case uh, you're not clear on what this does or um, the other features that you could do with this as well okay so definitely click on this link right here it has tutorials on uh, at that link as well all right so once you get done reading this full description you want to come up here where it says current and select the green arrow to download all right now let's go ahead and jump into the requirements the requirements we are going to need for this is of course blender all right i will leave all these links down in the description it will be um, to the download page of Blender. Uh, 2.93.6 is the version um, of this. Uh, like by the time I'm recording this video right now, this is the updated version of Blender right here. So you want to come and download and install Blender. Then the next requirement you are going to need is Cold Walker. When you get down to this page right here, um, what you want to do is go and check out the pin comment. All right, check out the pin comment they have their link to their discord what you want to do is join cold cold walkers discord in order to get the updated cold walker okay as you can see um on the download page they haven't updated it here but they updated on their discord okay so it's important that you get to the cold walker download page scroll down check out the pin comment and you will see their discord link join the discord link in order to get the most updated cold walker all right once you have that um the last requirement you're going to need is open four now i would say you need open four in order to get to a lot of these game files so if you wanted to modify uh something that's already inside the game of course you would need open four okay so all of these links will be linked down in the description we will not be showing how to install blender or open four i will leave a link down in the description showing you how to install open four if you don't have it already and um coat walker is um simple and easy we'll we'll kind of walk through that as well and uh, blender is just something that you download install and is, you're good to go okay so once you have all of your requirements downloaded as well as uh, your blender plugin all right as you can see I have my blender opened up and ready to go um, but before we jump into that let's get into um, our downloads now I have uh, three folders up one of them is the Solums, which is the blender plugin that we downloaded and then I have uh, the latest version of Cold Walker, and I have uh, a few examples, all right? Uh, this folder right here I created, and I just threw a few files in there that we could import, all right? So let's start off with the Solums folder, the, the Blender plugin that we downloaded from the GTA 5 Mods website, and let's go ahead and unzip that one. All right, to unzip it, you're going to need um, some type of program like 7-Zip or WinWar. Now let's go into the Solims folder. Inside the Solims folder is going to be another folder. All right, let's open that one up. Inside that folder is going to be two text documents and a, another compressed file. We want to leave this one compressed right here, okay? Do not unzip this one, all right? I repeat, do not unzip it. Now let's leave this one right here, okay? Remember where um, the path is to this folder inside your computer, okay? Now let's go into our blender. Let's go into edit at the top, select preferences. Then we want to select add-ons right here. And I am going to select install right here. Then a window will pop up. We want to find where our file is at, where our zip folder is at. Mine's is going to be in my tutorials folder. And I'm going to go inside the Solums folder. And then I'm going to find the zip right there, okay? So I'm selecting 
this one right here inside this window okay so once you have selected it select install add-on and give it a few seconds then you should see your add-on being installed right here now you want to select this box to enable the add-on there we go all right now that that box is selected minimize or exit out of that window um, we could also uh, get rid of this stuff that's in here also all right and I'm gonna go to file and then import all right now at the bottom you should see coat walker XML YDR XML YDD XML YFT XML and YBN XML all right so once you have successfully installed this add-on you should be able to import um, from cold walker xml's all right from all these different formats all right you'll see it down at the bottom of the list and import all right now let's go ahead and um get some stuff ready to import i have my cold walker opened up right here and i'm going to go back here to my example folder all right so inside of my cold walker i'm going to i'm going to go into my uh, mods folder right here all right so what i'm going to do here is just leave this here in the mods folder and then i'm going to go inside my examples folder and what i want to do is um i'm just going to grab um let's grab this one right here actually i'm gonna grab one of my car files i'll blow it up for you um i'm gonna grab one of my car files uh it's going to be um, a yft file i'm gonna drag that over here over here oh before i do that i have to select edit mode I always select edit mode <laughs> in code walker before you do any modifying all right once edit mode is on then i can go ahead and drag something into um code walker all right now that i've dragged that in code walker as you can see the file is right here i'm just going to right click on that file and then i'm going to select export xml all right I'm gonna select export XML then I'm going to find this examples folder right here it should be right to, oops in projects and I'll put it in examples select OK and as you can see I have my um, my yft .xml document file right here all right I'm gonna minimize both of these windows bring back blender and uh, we can exit out of um, our Blender preferences. Go to File, Import, Cold Walker. Select the Cold Walker XML. Then I'm going to go back to my folder where I have my examples. I'm gonna select my YFT XML and then select Import Cold Walker XML. This button right here. As you can see i have uh the car imported right here along with the collision and stuff like that i'm not going to go into details about this um this is only supposed to be just a tutorial on how to install the plugin into blender all right now let's um get rid of this one also and let's see if we could get another file imported in here as well and that was just to show you how to get a car in there you definitely want to check out that link on the download page that I had um, explained to you earlier that has um, a lot of more information on the wiki page. So definitely check that out. I'm going to grab uh, one of these right here, which is a YDD file. I'm going to go and drag and drop it. And this is a YDD file. This is a clothing file from uh, the game. Okay, this is just um, a shirt from the game. Um, let's go ahead and right click on that. Export to XML select the same place all right now we have our ydd.xml file right here let's go back into blender select file import scroll down to the bottom select code walker xml then i'm going to select um, my ydd.xml then select import code walker xml and as you can see right here we have our uh clothing imported into blender straight from uh, gta 
all right now i'm not going to like i said this isn't a tutorial on how to edit stuff it's just a simple tutorial on um installing the plugin into blender and showing you how to import a few files from gta 5 all right now like i said i urge you again to read the full description on the download page and go to the wiki page that the creator has provided there's plenty of information on there to show you how to do a little bit more things than um just what i did right here okay so we're going to end this tutorial right here but if this helped y'all out to um, install everything and um get the plug in and get a better understanding of it then go ahead and smash that like button for me definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and share the video with y'all friends that are in the modding gta 5 y'all this is games and graphics i'm out here till next time i ain't scared of you motherfuckers